Assalamu alaikum. Hope you are doing fine. In my previous video, I explained how to magnetize a substance using single touch method. Here I have a spool which sticks to magnet. It shows that it is a magnetic material. Now when I bring it near to paper clips, you can see do not the stick to the paper clip. This shows that it is not the, a magnet. Now I will magnetize this by following the same method. Just rub this with magnet thrice. Now I bring it near to the paper clips. You can see large number of paper clips get attracted to the spoon. It shows that the spoon has got magnetized. The magnetic field which magnetizes a substance is referred as magnetizing field. It is a vector quality which is represented by letter H vector and its unit is ampere per meter. Similarly, when I try to magnetize this nail, now before going ahead, I will check that it is not a, a magnet. I will follow the same method. I will rub this nail thrice with the, the magnet. One, two, and three. As I did to the spoon. Here, when I bring it near to the magnet, you can see it attracts the paper clips. But uh, there is a difference in the number of uh, paper clips attracted by these two substances. Here, the spoon attracts a more number of paper clips. It shows that the measure of capacity of uh, this spoon to get magnetized is more than the nail. This measure of capacity of uh, the substance to take magnetization is referred as permeability. It is otherwise defined as the measure of ability of a substance to allow the passage of the magnetic field lines through it. It is denoted by letter mu. It is a Greek letter which is read as mu. This permeability in free space is denoted as mu naught. It is a, a scalar quantity in isotropic medium. Whereas in a non isotropic medium the same quantity acts as tensor here we come across the three new terms isotropic non isotropic medium and a tensor let me tell you what do they mean here isotropic medium have the same permeability in all direction whereas the permeability of non isotropic medium varies with the direction we call the such a substance as non isotropic medium now what do you mean by tensor tensor is similar to vector quantity but there is a small difference vector have magnitude and direction whereas Tensor have multiple direction along with the magnitude. Now, there is one thing called as relative per permeability. Relative permeability. Relative permeability is denoted by letter mu r. It is defined as the ratio between permeability of the medium to the permeability of free space. It is a dimensionless quantity. What is dimensionless quantity? Because we divide the same term with another term. So it has got the no unit. 
no unit and uh, it is dimensionless dimensionless quantity here the value of a radio permeability is 1 for vacuum vacuum is free space it has got the value for relative permeability as 1 and uh, here mu naught means uh, permeability of free space permeability of uh, free space free space means vacuum I hope uh, this video is useful if you have any kind of doubt related to the topic kindly put your questions in the comment section thanks for watching